Hi. This doesn't we seem had right. to go vertical. This doesn't seem right when you do no, it vertically. No, we had to. We had to. We, we had need, to make the foam be vertical because it's not flipping. We need help now. First, the problem was I was I was be. just cold and wet from my run. <laughs> it's terrible. Still now outside. you're sweating. Now I'm sweating, and I'm also vertical and too bright. So if you know how to solve the problem, what is the problem exactly? Someone will comment and tell us. It won't go on landscape. It stays on portrait. Why yeah. is that? I don't know. I mean, it must be. Maybe it's my phone. I need an iPhone 7. That's why. <laughs> How are you doing? Did you have a nice weekend? How come I can't see us on, on there? Oh, I have to refresh the screen here. Are the Cubs still, so, on, a, a Cubs still on a rain delay? If you share... Th thank no, you, We can Ken. see the comments. Yeah, we can see the comments. Every day it's like a new thing. Like we, yeah. There's something the that we can do. The Russians. Oh, and, and look at how weird our screen, the proportions. Look. I know. So we're never we're we look, never this close we, to each other. And we look foggy too. <laughs> no, that's only on the sides. Oh. Did you have a nice weekend? And we look foggy in the middle too. Um, yes, yes, you do need the iPhone Seven, says Lynn. See, she knows what she's talking about. Hey, Patrick. <laughs> David Happy was, Monday. David was watching sideways. Yeah. Hey, people, listen. Hey, Jim. People, wet weekend. Yes. People um, are commenting on uh, how tan Chicagoans are, but it's it's not tan. But, it's not suntan. It, everybody's rusted from the weekend. <laughs> okay, so here's an update on what happened with us. Remember that we were going to go college shopping. Our daughter, our 16 year old daughter, Daniela, and I were going to go. And I was saying, Bob, come on, please go. You know, you can do it. You know, fly up there or drive up there. Keep us company at least one of the days because he had to work because he does not know how to ask for a day off. This is how Bob asks our boss for a day off. He'll say, you know, I would like to go with Marianne. Hang on, I'm going to turn a light off yes. while you're doing this. <laughs> Pete, I know you're kidding me, but yes, we do have a, a, a YouTube channel. Thanks for reminding me. Is that better? No, I don't know. Is it? Is that better? No. That's too dark, I think. Anyway, uh, so the way that Bob asks for a day off, and I don't know if you are an employer or if you're an employee, and, and I'd love your feedback uh, on this. Uh, oh, we drove right by Lafayette, Indiana. And um, he. what did you say to him? What did you say to our boss? You said something like, uh, well, Marianne would like for me to take the day off, but... Would that be okay? It's you not, know, like, not, not if, not if exactly like, would that be too much of an inconvenience? And then he said, yes, it would be. So he couldn't go. The light off looked better. You're right. I'm going to turn the light the off. The light off looked better? Yeah, it did look better. Okay. Thanks, Steve. Boy, you know, this is a professional. If anybody needs any videos uh, done, uh, edited, shot, whatever, Steve Faniza is unbelievable. Contact him right there because he is really absolutely the best. And Steve, we want to work with you again. And I know you just went to Jamaica, and, uh, you know, uh, we wish we had been there. <laughs> anyway, okay, so should back to... On, should, hey, Steve, should I turn another light off? <laughs> anyway, um, so he didn't know how to ask for the day off, so he had to work, because the boss said it was inconvenient for him to be off. <laughs> so... Anyway, wow. we had to, um, I had to go with my daughter, and then Bob surprised us. He was so nice that he flew in and he met us in Indianapolis. Is that nice or what? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, right. Lynn says, oh, Bob, just tell them you are taking the day off, silly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's speechless. So... I knew this would happen, but after <laughs> decades on radio and TV in Chicago, Thanks, it Danny. finally happened. I knew this day would come. What I've run that? out of things to say. You have? I've completely run out of <laughs> things to say. Don't say that, please. Um, okay, so uh, anyway, so uh, we went to see four colleges this weekend. We went to DePaul University, which is really cute. If you want to hear the whole story. We went story. to Dayton in Ohio, in Ohio. Go we to, went to Ohio State, and then we went to Indiana University, and we had a great time. And if you want to hear how my surprise got screwed up, 
<laughs> go to the uh, listen to our podcast. You just go to our show page at wlsam.com. Listen to the podcast from this morning's ten to noon show, and you'll hear the whole story. I can't. Okay. I don't have the energy to repeat it now, though. Why? No, I don't have. The okay, energy so to here's it. the other thing: is that we uh, we were told. I did go. Yeah, I flew down Friday night. We were told that once we start the Facebook Live, we should share it on our page. So that's what I'm going to do right now. Um, I'm going to say, watch this now. Boy, it plays Jim Wright. No good deed goes unpunished. I know. But you know what? What happened? I mean, tell the truth of what happened. I know that you're very... <laughs> huh? I know what's wrong with you, Bob. Yeah, I'm I know wet. You I'm so all well. wet because I no. just ran. I, I know it's wrong. I a 30-minute run. No, I know it's wrong. What's that? What is she going to college for? I don't know. She's like a high school junior right now. To avoid now. the draft. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong is that yeah. you're you're disoriented. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Because the phone yeah. is vertical. I, I, well, I can see <laughs> the comments. Horizontal. Last couple of nights. Thank uh, you, Carlton. Last, uh, on our last Facebook Live on Thursday night, we couldn't see comments at all. Remember? Right. I know. I know. So, all right. So I just shared on my Facebook page. Why don't you do the same? If you are, if it's handy, if you know how to do it. You can share this, and then if you share this, um, you know, other, other people will see it. So, um, what, one thing that I wanted to just, I feel like I'm out of the screen. One thing that I wanted to say was that if, if you've ever liked anything on our page, I've invited you. I've personally invited you to like our, our Serrat and Marciano page or our Suso's Fork page. So, we can't invite you again. So, well, you would well, just have to. like that? <laughs> Why oh, because. Oh, there See? you go. Would um, I look better fat? <laughs> I can tell that you've run out of things to say. I forgot what I was saying. <laughs> anyway, so how was your weekend? Tell us about that. Well, hey, get your own Facebook Live. Go to University <laughs> of... Uh, U of I. Oh, U of I in, in Champaign. Mm -hmm. We did. We went... Uh, last fall, I think it was, or yeah, I think it was last fall. But we're gonna go again. We're, no, we went in the in the winter. We're gonna go again because she didn't really like the campus that much. But I think it's because it was cold and nobody was out there. We weren't getting like a real tour. Yeah, see that Joan says I look washed out. How come Marianne never looks washed because out? Because I have dark hair. Don't don't turn off any more lights. <laughs> I'm gonna just I'll stay back here. Maybe this is better. But, and I look like Morticia. <laughs> Anybody know the significance of May 2nd? Rain all weekend in Valpo. Any, anybody know the significance of May 2nd in Chicago broadcasting? I'm Stephanie curious. says, hey, Stephanie, um, I heard the NFL draft was in Philadelphia. Yeah, hmm. we, we lost it. We don't have it here anymore. We don't have it? Cubs uh, are uh, starting soon. It's raining. Look at this. Lynn has a great idea. Put a hat on. If you put a hat on, I bet you you won't be looking okay. so washed out. Has anybody so. <laughs> answered my question yet? What's your question? Oh, baby shower for my daughter. What's the significance? Thank you for sharing our live post. What's the significance of May oh, 2nd in Chicago broadcasting? Uh, great new restaurant at U of I, Hamilton. <laughs> Bob. Uh, I feel like uh, Bob's pink hat. That's worse now. I think it needs to be a darker color. Franklin College in South Suburban Indy is a wonderful college experience for my daughter. She loves it and her sorority. The decision is a painless one. Any other hats down here? Just They're put something upstairs. dark like around your head and see. Let's see. Here. Okay. So I bet you that this is going to what? be. No, no, no. Wait. No. Here. Let me help you. There. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see what happens if we um, if we make it dark <laughs> around your face. What? Wait, da wait. Danny's going to Italy on vacation? Danny? Wow. <gasps> oh, wow. Yeah, bring us some uh, pasta back. <laughs> this How's is that? See? This is way better. It's so yeah. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> 
<laughs> now you don't look so washed out. That's, hey, give me your. Give this me your, is what give I me, feel like give at me, all times. Give me a give me a ruler, and you'll feel like you're back in that Catholic all girls school of yours in Miami. <laughs> this is what I feel like at all times because I have dark hair. It's so, not a good look, I so, don't think. Well, it's my look. See, um, all right. Hold on, Connie. Dick Biondi's WLS anniversary. How did you know that? Yeah. That should have been a question. Not there should only, have been a prize. There not, should have been a prize. Well, not only his anniversary, but that was when the new WLS started playing rock and roll. May 2nd, 1960. That's when the rock and roll format began. Very good. Wow. You know what? Hi from Stager, tomorrow, Illinois. Thank tomorrow, you so much, Debbie. Tomorrow on our radio show, in honor of that, I'll play a few of the original jingles from WLS. Would that be a good thing? Would you want to hear those? If so, maybe once every uh, half hour or so, play an old original jingle from WLS, and we'll just wish our station happy anniversary. Um, well, where are those, and what format are they in? And I are play you, them from are time you to time. promising you ever something? You ever listen to our show? <laughs> are I, you I've promising something that you can't I've deliver? A couple. You know, I have that CD that somebody that a WLS engineer gave me the, from the original master of the jingles. Joan says the yellow wall in the background doesn't help, but we—I mean, we can't control that. Oh well, yeah, wait a minute. What if I turn the lights but, down back there? See, and when you leave the picture, the fine. lighting on me looks a lot better. <laughs> Why don't you stay back there, Bob? About that. No, 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 no. No, no. Turn those back on. Because now I look really, really white. Yeah, we're trying to figure this out. Bob, just come over here and... and How about if I turn these on? No, no. Too bright. No. Bob, will you come back here, please? <laughs> All right, uh, perfect when Bob walks away. It's true, yeah. Much better, everybody says. But then the minute you come on, it's because you have blonde hair and lighter skin, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, see, look, it's that light there. No, please don't turn it off. No, don't turn it off. Don't turn it off. No, no. Okay. Um, yeah, it's it's the it's the yellow wall probably. And also, by you know, the way, I look this format, washed up too. But, but it's my dark hair. In like the vertical if, format is, is much worse. If though. my hair wasn't dark, like if I covered up... Okay, I'm going to get rid of like my all the... Format. Oh, but I'm wearing a black top. So I think that's part of the problem. Okay, look. We'll put on something pink. See how it changes the color? Look at this. Oh, yeah, you're right. It does. And then go back to this. And maybe we're not as washed out. I don't know. You're glowing is what is. <laughs> Hi, Myra. Are you there? Shut the light off next to Bob. There's no light on next to Bob. That They're one? in front of us. Like this one. I think they mean this one. By the time we adjust the lights, <laughs> it'll be, time to, it'll be time to say goodnight. How's that? How's that? Oh, That's that better. might be better. Until you get in the picture. Well, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me, you know what? We don't need lights. <laughs> I we think. definitely need lights. No, wait a minute. no. How does that look? No, that looks bad. Really? Yeah, that looks bad. Sure. Oh wait. Blurry. It looks bad and blurry. Yeah, leave it on. Leave that one on too. No, that one. No, leave it on. Leave it on. You sure? Yeah. Yeah. Somebody suggested that we switch spots. Why don't you stay? Why don't you come over here on this side? I never want to shoot this way because Bob always leaves that door open. <laughs> now you look really short. Sorry. <laughs> By the time we get this adjusted, <laughs> I now I look more like Morticia. I like well, I'm comfy back here. Don't know. Hey, remember Sarah Jewel and Muji Burr on the old David Letterman show? That's what this Hi, reminds me of. <laughs> I should not be this close. No, uh, Jim says know. that helped a lot. Oh, Val from Hawaii. Aloha. What else is going on today? Ryan Val Seacrest. says, I feel like I know you already. Hope you come to visit Hawaii soon. You missed celebrating my birthday in paradise. Did What did you do for your birthday in paradise? Hey, you know what? It's got to be so nice. Should we make the announcement now about Ryan Seacrest is replacing us on Facebook Live? <laughs> I think people by now have heard, oh, so you know what we He's did He's going to have morning? a new job. He's going to host our Facebook Live now. He doesn't have enough jobs. <laughs> That would be great. He's gonna he's gonna be the new Michael Strahan with Kelly Ripa. 
Yes, he is. So listen to what happened this morning. So we're getting ready for for work. You're like, so I like far. It. I like it back here. You're so far back. No, I look good back here. <laughs> I think I just that can't I, read anybody's comments. Yeah, you're too far back. I don't like it. So we're getting ready for work. We, we were getting ready for work. Bob was doing his his fatherly duties. Mm-hmm. Oh, Val went to Disney Aulani. Thought of you when I had my French press Kona coffee. Oh, how fun. Finish your story. Oh, nice. So we're getting ready for work, and Bob is doing his fatherly duties, which entail making breakfast for our daughter, Hi, complaining about making breakfast for our daughter, warning me that I better not be late. <laughs> All the things he does every morning. So it tires me up before I even <laughs> sign on at 10 a.m. <laughs> Getting mad at me for making a green shake that's going to delay him and all that stuff. And then I get an urgent on my phone. And, of course, the first thing I think about is Kim Jong-un <laughs> and Trump. Yeah. And I feel like, oh, no, like, what happened now? But the urgent that I got was that Ryan Seacrest had been hired <laughs> to replace Michael Strahan on Kelly, what's it called? Kelly, the Live Ke- with Kelly? The Kelly, and it used to be Regis' show. Yeah, and uh, the minute that came over, guess what we did? We thought, hey, we have five minutes to spare. Let's record on our webcam our reaction to it so we can post it on our YouTube channel. Mm-hmm. Was that a good idea or not? I'll tell you, I'll tell you exactly what happened. I'll tell you how many people there we go. actually watched it. Oh, look, we got one more one more subscriber, or sub, as they're called. We got 170 views. Mm-hmm. Come on, we need to have, like, I don't know, like 100,000 views, you know? <laughs> and that's just not happening. And that's why we keep begging for subscribers. I, I, I know a way to get views up there. How? Here, I'll hold your clothes. Either that or I could just have a baby giraffe or something. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, I That's know. That's exactly right. So, uh, yeah, so we don't know if it was worth it, you know, because all we did is we sat, first of all, the shelves behind us in my office, they're so messy, and we didn't have Nobody a choice. Cares. It's like Channel 2 I News. Care. It's not pretty, but it's real. That was our slogan back I in the care. 80s, number one news in Chicago. I care. Yeah, and please, if you do see that video on our YouTube channel, which is called Serrat and Marciano, and by the way, the link is posted right here on top of us. By the way, let's hear hear for some new folks, some virgin commenters. I enjoy hearing... Lynn says it was worth it. I enjoy seeing the comments of our regulars. How about some virgins tonight? (laughs) First-timers. You know how they call radio shows? First-time caller, first whatever they say. What do people say? First-time caller? Yeah, first-time caller. Long-time listener? Yeah. Let's see some first-time commenter, long-time viewer. Let's Thank see you, Lynn. Those. Lynn shared it even to LinkedIn. Now, I don't really know how to use LinkedIn that much. I don't People either. are always asking me. All I know is that I have many, many, many LinkedIn friends who are sheiks and who are, live in Dubai. And I have no idea why. Like, I honestly don't know one person who lives in Dubai. And yet, I have a lot of people who are my friends and I have said yes to everybody, and now I'm thinking maybe I shouldn't have. So what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to be posting. <laughs> Bob is like looking at himself in the mirror. <laughs> He's uh, checking the lighting. He's primping. The lighting is all wrong. It's all too bright. Um, thank you very much, Diane. Thank you, everybody. You guys are so unbelievable. Do not change anything. They will come, says Todd. Okay. That's you know what? I'm really glad you said that. That's a, that makes sense. Kind of like if you build it, they will come. Is that what you mean, mm-hmm, Todd? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, my daughter and friend were there. They were where? Does anybody like gardening? Because tomorrow <laughs> on the show, we're finally going to have that gardening expert. And, and what, do you, what is the question? I, I, oh, somebody suggested I ask about growing medical marijuana. I'll ask tomorrow, I promise, between 10 and noon, WLSAM 890, and Marianne will ask about bulbs, right? And the best, whether you get fluorescent, yes. is it fluorescent or uh, Thanks, inc- Lynn. In, incandescent, which are the best bulbs? 
Vicky says, tomorrow. if you post it, they will come. I love that. Mm -hmm. I'm going to steal that. Well, I'm going to borrow that. Is that okay, Vicky? I did. love that. If you post it, they will come. I hope that that's, I, I hope that's true. Thank you I'm so much. Yeah, you guys are so nice. And um, we have something to give away tonight, right? Don't we? Yeah, this shirt right here. It's, uh, Wait, no, uh, we already gave that away. Well, we have this another one. Did you really send it to somebody? Yeah, we have we have more than one. Yeah. I don't believe him. All right. Well, Rudy we'll, says we'll give, we can give away the White Sox thing, but the White Sox did, are okay. playing tonight. Let's not give that away. Did tonight. you actually? Somebody might be watching this. All right. Thing. Did you actually take the the hot pink T-shirt? I think to I work? did. I, I don't remember. No. Well, let's give I away a book. I, you did not. You want to give away a book? And then those books we've already given them out no, I sent, again. No, and no, 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 yes. No, I mailed those. These are, somebody won one. Emerald. Yeah, no, they didn't. And somebody won Blast the Sugar. Yes, I sent it out already. I don't trust him. <laughs> I really, I really don't because I have this a feeling didn't work that out. It, nobody wanted this. The, the guy, uh, I think Jim or somebody who wanted, he had it already. Oh, Diane says she's been gardening for over fifty-six years. You must be very tired. Come in out of the. Out of the cold and rain, my God, 56 years out there. Come in and <laughs> U of I is a you city. Must be very tired. Is your daughter ready for such a huge campus? Okay, can I just address that for a second? Yeah, sure. I'll I, wait back here. I cannot even believe like our experience. Let me t just tell you this. So she goes to a very big high school, so like a lot of people. Mm -hmm. And so I thought she's used to that. And so we went to see a tiny school called DePauw. You probably have heard of it. And it's in Indiana. Beautiful, beautiful little school. And only like 2,300 students. And she was so, I mean, she just felt like it was so small that there's no way she could go to school there, I don't think. And then we went to see another one called Dayton, which is a me medium-sized school. And she really felt comfortable in that in that environment of mm -hmm. a medium-sized school. Mm -hmm. Then we went to Ohio State, which mm -hmm. has 60,000 students. Bob is primping. He's trying to get out of his life, <laughs> getting sunburned. This is what he life. looks like when, he, when he's looking in the mirror. And so uh, 60,000 students, that was ridiculous. So then by the time we got to Indiana, and it was a campus of 40,000 undergrads and, and uh, 10,000 more, graduates, it didn't seem as big, but whatever. I don't know. Uh, wait, Patrick, that's an awesome idea. What was the idea? I didn't see that. Fun going on college tours. Please do a live college tour. I don't know. No, I don't think we're going to do that. That's It's too stressful. How are we going to give away the book? And this is the book that uh, we had that people didn't want to win it. So it's Emerald's TV Dinners. Kicking it up a notch with recipes from Emerald Live and Essence of Emerald is seen on the Food Network. Emerald Lagasse has got some great recipes in here, and we're going to give the book away uh, tonight. And uh, here's uh, Marianne. Tell the folks at home how they Vicky can Vicki says, uh, I hear Indiana is a big party school, though. Yeah, but guess what? They They're all? all party schools. They really all are. SIU, uh, Carbondale. My daughter to went to Northwestern. One. Lucky girl got the Western Golf... Oh, wow. Scholarship. That's awesome. That's yeah. really, that is so cool. Rooftop party. Boom. Yeah, college tours are fun. Boomf? No. no, he said oh, bam. Boomf. That's a Honeymooners. Bam. Bam. Yeah. Well, I watched the Honeymooners episode last night where Ralph thinks he's getting $40 million because the woman leaves him her fortune. That is still so funny. I watched that last night on channel on MeTV. Hey, so, you know what? I have a question. Um, does I, Did anybody see The Immortal Life of Emerald Lagasse? The Immortal Life of Henrietta Lacks. Did anybody see that or read that book? Hey, Oprah was great, but it's very confusing, and they needed you know, to tell I, that story a little better. I read that book, and I thought, I could not believe how great that book was. So, coming from the perspective of having seen the book, I don't know, I, I thought that the movie was, it didn't explain enough for, I was watching it with two people, our daughter and Bob, two people who knew nothing about it. And I just, I don't know if they really explained as much as they could have 
what that was all about. Right. Did you get yeah. it? I didn't. They didn't explain it enough, but it was good. Yeah. It was powerful. It was powerful, yeah. Um, okay, so how are we going to give this away? Does it always have to be a YouTube-related contest? Yeah, because the whole goal is that we want all our friends to go to our YouTube page. Okay, the link is right above us, and you can... Uh, good night, Patrick. Uh, Patrick's going to put his son, Sean, to bed. Good night, Sean. Um, How did they win? Wait a minute. Contest? Lynn, see, I knew this. I cannot even believe this. This is so annoying. Lynn says that's her book. <laughs> see, I knew it. He's giving away things that have already been given away. Well, let's get caught up. Lynn, so we won't do it she time says... Time. No, she says, no, I thought, read your emails. I did, but I thought... Oh, my God. Lynn. No, that was the night that Lynn <sighs> said, give it to somebody else. No, then, this Lynn, I'm sending you this book. We're sending you this book. Could you please get another prize? Lynn, Go get another prize. Well, Lynn, you're going to have to send me another email with your info and remind me it's the Emerald Book. And Do send, you believe that? Send your address to Bob and Marianne at WLS. Do you believe that? Excuse me? Excuse me? <laughs> Send your email to Bob and Marianne at WLSAM.com. The problem is... You sound like you've been drinking be a, food. This is going to be a job for our producer. We don't have the new we producer, producer yet. yet. I'm not... I, I can't do this. Oh, my God. I knew... I had a feeling. Right, we'll give away the Wolfgang Puck book. Have we given that one away? Have we no. given away the Wolfgang Puck? I'm not... Puck? You know what? That's it. No more contests because I can't do the paperwork. When we get it from our, our producer, we'll Oh, do stop it. it. All right, All how right. are we giving away the Wolfgang Puck book? I have a feeling we've already given this away. Okay. Have we given this away to any of you? No. <laughs> oh, Todd says it's okay to forget. Here's the... Here's the uh, I don't know. I'd have to go back in the records to see if... Lynn the records? Listed. You know what the records are? It's, no, it's the good. records are... Bob is going one by one I through, all, the the, through all his... Me no, I fill out the grid. <laughs> emails. Fill up the grid. Okay. All right. Oh, this Here. is good. You figure out a way to give it away. <laughs> okay, so remember the time that, okay, one time we had Wolfgang Puck Ooh, on our some good recipes Fox in thing book. in the morning um, show, and I'll never forget what he made. Oh, Wolfgang my God. Wolfgang Puck, Adventures in the Kitchen, 175 new recipes from uh, Spago and other restaurants. That's the book you can win tonight. Stand by, we'll tell you how. Okay, so... Um, when he was at the station, he went to see us at Foxley in the morning, you know, many, many years ago. He made the most delicious, I haven't made it in a long time, but he made these burgers Thank that you, were Eric. so good. Thank you, Eric. They were like s ground sirloin, and then he stuffed them with blue cheese and garlic. The I wonder if that, if that recipe is... <laughs> Somebody wants to win a bottle of wine. No, that, that's our bottle of Vouv that we're going to... Once we get um, 10,000... YouTube subscribers, we're going to open up that bottle right on camera. Yeah, I put post-it notes on the prizes, but sometimes I forget. Okay, would it be under burger? I don't see any burger recipes here. It would be here. under hamburger, not burger. Oh, hamburger. <laughs> What's the matter with you? English is not my native tongue. That's what it is. Ham, ham hash, hash. There's nothing. All right. Go to yeah, YouTube. There's nothing. Anyway. Be um, the first person to comment on YouTube with the correct answer to this question that you can only answer wait, no, if you not, check out the Serata Murciano YouTube channel. The question is. No, but they don't comment on YouTube. They comment no, here. Comment here to But win. you said First on person YouTube. to comment correctly here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What's the so, question? all right. The thumbnail that we. Um, People don't know what a thumbnail is. Explain it. It's the little picture. That's posted there with a little title. On our YouTube channel. Yeah. Okay. So the the picture that we posted this morning with breaking Ryan secrets. <laughs> there you go, primping again. <laughs> You're just you know, I was just thinking of this morning. <laughs> watching yourself. Telling a story about the Bears uh, big draft pick and the quarterback pick and you know, I'm five <laughs> minutes into the story and Marianne says to me, Who are you, who are you talking about? And I realize she's not listening to the show. <laughs> so, would you please listen to the show tomorrow, 10 to noon, WLSAM 890, because Marianne doesn't listen. I listen, but it's just when you start reading something that I get a little a little tired. Look, Eric says, do these earlier, so Bob isn't so tired. 
Yeah. We got to wrap this up. I got to go watch the Cubs game. Did they start yet? Oh, look at all those thumbs up. Thank you so much. Um, What's the question? Let's get okay, the question is, away. do you know what the thumbnail is? So go to our YouTube page and see the last thing that we uploaded about Ryan Seacrest. Yeah. And tell us, um, I don't know. Wow. Uh, uh, look at that. Isn't that wild? Did you, are you kidding me? Turn that off. I'm watching our video. Our live, <laughs> that's not our, that's our not Facebook a video. Live. Oh my God, my, hair, my head is exploding. <laughs> I don't know how I, I did that. Who's Who else is in the picture with us? Wait, oh, my wait. God. No, no, turn that off. I'm going to comment. I'm going to comment. Look, it's 7-zip. They're I, losing. What? What? No. no. Bob seems to be I said, hi, it's Bob. Is my comment on there yet? Yes, I just saw it. <laughs> <laughs> Bob. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't take much. All right, do we know? give it away yet? Because I'm oh closing Oh my God, this wait up. a minute. I forgot to look. I'm closing this down right now. Who won? I don't know. Philly 7, Cubs nothing? It, it, really? What happened? The, you know what happened? The Cubs got in at 3 a.m. from Boston. That's what happened. They should have called the game tonight. Giving them a rest. Thank you very much. Wait, I don't know. Did we ask the question? Cubs are losing, Bob. Uh, no. Cannot get into YouTube. The link is right above this post. Like, part of this post includes a link. 652 views? Of what? What are you talking about? <laughs> Rick, says Second he, Rick says he won. Is that true? Did Rick win? Rick, R-I-C, did he win? I don't know. I don't know. Did you say what was on that... Who else is in that picture Well, with us? It's coming up. It's a little delayed here. The voice is not synced with the audio. Because this is a Japanese Facebook <laughs> Live tonight. That's why. What does that mean? There is no link above. There isn't? Wait, this, let me see. This Facebook Live. Yes, it? there is. I'm this looking at it. This is a disaster, it. as it says, Trump would say. Okay, it says right above of, of us is... The failing Facebook right above Live. Us. It says, Facebook Thing Live, Monday edition. Join us, like us, share us link to our YouTube page, and then right under that, it's got the link. But honestly, I don't know who won. Bob, let's go to Cuba. <laughs> You'd be fun to travel with. Uh, I, don't know if any, I don't know if anybody won. The live Rick, Facebook Rick says, you're doing now, 652 Rick, views. Who cares? No. Rick says he won. I'll sell the book if someone wants it. Well, Rick, uh, if you, you won... You can't sell it. you got to sign something like the Cubs have to with the World Series ring, saying you can't sell the prizes. No, you guys, listen. You know, we want to have a lot of views, right? But it's got to be 300 people tuned in at the same time. Well, we know we have, like, by the time we're done with this, we'll have, like, sometimes it's 2,000 views. I mean, we have a lot. Well, why don't we close this up because everything is messed up tonight. The, the phone is a different way. The audio is weird. <laughs> the prizes are mixed up. Let's just <laughs> My call, glasses are crooked. Let's call this off due to wet grounds. <laughs> I know. My glasses are a little bit crooked. Okay. Rick can't wait for the book. Well, Rick, well, do you well, know what to do? Tell him what to do. Did he win? Yes. Yes. Uh, yeah. Hey, people, did Rick really win? <laughs> Uh, if, if Rick, if you did, you can email me your address and remind me. It's you easy to tell. Wolfgang Puck book, and I'll send it to you. And the email is uh, Bob and Marianne at WLSAM dot com. We'll check it later on. Yeah, Rick, he doesn't mean to sound so mean. I believe that you won, and I, I just wasn't looking. I had any any final thoughts? I yeah. As George, I this is a George. Klein I don't get always, half these George jokes. George Klein but... always says that on the Elvis channel when he's interviewing somebody. Any final thoughts about Elvis? I think that's his way of thinking, buying time to think of another question. It, am I the only one? Who Caesar. Listens, am says I the only one who listens to George Klein on Friday? He won on, on the Elvis channel. Anybody else listen? Cesar Caesar. Cortez right. says we'll he see won. See you tomorrow night in oh the basement God. here on Facebook Live. Hopefully we'll get our technical issues resolved. Thank you so much. Hopefully we'll be... And see you on the radio tomorrow. We'll be this way. Like this. <laughs>
But I, I like it like this because people can watch while they're resting. Uh, but we can't read the comments. Resting. All right. Good night. Thank you so oh, much. Look at that.